For me, while I want soccer to grow internationally, I'm more concerned about my home state, home mm -hmm. area, because I know so many little girls that I've coached or seen who love the sport, but mm -hmm. when you get to a certain age, it's not big there, and so they have nowhere to grow. Hey, Catherine Woodman, mm -hmm. uh, you came all the way from uh, Lafayette, Louisiana to uh, play with uh, shot women. Uh, we're very happy to have the chance to talk to you. Um, thanks for taking the time. Yeah, thanks for having me. I'm excited. Du hast uh, für Cajun Rush in der um, Golf Coast Premier League gespielt, uh, die auch erst seit 2021 uh, einen Frauenbereich hat. Um, was für Erfahrungen hast du da gesammelt und wie waren quasi so diese Anfangszeiten? The first year the team was there was also mm -hmm. the first year of that yeah. league. Um, and so there was big gaps in some games. Some games were mm -hmm. very high level, some were lower level. Um, and so it was adjusting to trying to keep our play at the same level. And then the next year, I felt like the league did a very good job of um, kind of promoting itself mm -hmm. and it grew a lot. And then each game was very intense and it was a more even playing field. And so it was about consistency at that point. And I think it was a really good way to bring girls in our area together who mm -hmm. may play at different levels in college and help us learn from each other as well. Und ähm, dein Verein hatte ja eben auch ein Männer- und ein Frauenteam, wie es bei Schott auch so ist, beziehungsweise die Schott-Frauen werden ja dann eben auch zu 05erinnen und sind da natürlich auch in einem Verein mit Männern. Was würdest du denn sagen, ähm, was ist der Vorteil daraus, dass man diese vielleicht etwas schon etablierteren Strukturen im Männerfußball eben auch nutzt für die Frauen? I think it's really helpful to have the support because uh, at home we were on the same level so it mm -hmm. was we were building together and it wasn't really that there was one above the other or um, and we, it was the first couple years so it was kind of hard to get momentum and yeah. to get extra funding or anything um, so I think having the structure and the fan base and the facilities already because um, I feel like it's a lot harder to get those things when you're yeah. a female soccer player so or foosball player <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but um, yeah so I'm very excited to, to have that and to have something to look up to that they're in the Bundesliga so mm -hmm. we want to promote into Bundesliga Spy so to be able to look up to that is cool. Du hast bei einer Talentsichtung in Saarbrücken gespielt. Da ist der erste äh, Kontakt mit Schott zusammengekommen. Da haben US-Spielerinnen sich gezeigt. Äh, was war für dich der Anlass, um da überhaupt teilzunehmen? Was hat dich daran interessiert, eben in Deutschland auch Fußball zu spielen? I had tried out for a NWSL team, which is our first tier in the States. Yeah. And I was told um, that I need to work on my tactics and the best place to do that would be in Europe just in general, not necessarily Germany. Um, and so looking for different ways of getting here, I found the women's soccer combine. And it just so happened to be in Germany and was held in Saarbrücken. And we actually played our scrimmage on the field over mm -hmm. here. Um, and so that's kind of how it led to Germany and here in Mainz. But it was more about um, getting out of the States and learning how to be more tactical. Because um, that's not really the strengths in the States. Okay. Yeah. Wir drehen uh, zwei, drei Tage vor eurem wichtigen Spiel gegen Saarbrücken. Du hast zuletzt uh, in drei Spielen zwei Tore geschossen. Wie hat das funktioniert, dass du so schnell in diesem Team integriert warst? Um, I felt like in my first not even practice with the team, trial practicing with the team, that the girls around me, like I fit in, like I had known them for a while, mm -hmm. and we played pretty well already. And I think it was more about my teammates coming, making me feel comfortable and translating everything. I never had to ask what does something mean because I had three different people helping mm -hmm. me. So I feel like they wanted me to feel comfortable and fit in and so with that I felt comfortable with them and I think that's why we mesh so well. Wir haben uns schon drüber unterhalten, ähm, die Ambitionen in äh, Mainz sind groß, man möchte gerne in die zweite Liga aufsteigen. Wo siehst du die Stärken von dem Team und wo könnt ihr euch aber vielleicht als Team auch noch entwickeln? Um, yeah, I think the strength is that everyone seems to be hungry to promote. Mm -hmm. Some of the other teams I was with or trialed with, they didn't have that same hunger in every practice, in every drill. Um, and so I think everyone's on the same page of us wanting to promote. Mm -hmm. Um, I think we have a lot of talent, like all of our players are really, really talented and I think where we could grow is on the field meshing. We, we have moments where we're all on the same page and we're clicking really well um, and then there's moments where someone makes a different run to what they're mm -hmm. playing. Or So I think when we all get on the same page and kind of 
are more used to each other, mm -hmm. especially for me coming in mid-season, I guess. I think that's where we have a lot of room to grow. Mm -hmm. um, I guess consistency from game to game. Mm -hmm. But I think we have a lot of talented girls and a very good mindset of wanting to promote. Das passt ja, weil ähm, auch hier bei Shot viele von euch Spielerinnen auch als Trainerinnen arbeiten und ähm, auch du trainierst schon eine kleine Gruppe, oder? Yes, yes I do. Um, I actually do that today with Fußball Schule. Um, yeah, I'm with three to four, five to six, seven to eight year old, mostly boys, a couple mm -hmm. little girls, but yeah, and then a couple of the teammates also coach. Also, uh, sorgst du selber schon mit für den Nachwuchs, sehr schön. So, you help grow the game, that's really special. Yes, yeah, I love <laughs> working with the kids and seeing them love it, so I hope it, it's mutual for me, like teaching them and hoping that they love it and want to play it, but it's also, I have fun doing it, it reminds me why I love the game. Thank you so much for taking the time. At the end of every shoot, uh, my guest gets uh, this little bag with, I don't know if you have gummy bears in the States. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> They're actually Mainz 05 branded. So uh, cool. thank you so much for taking the time. Yeah. It was a great pleasure. Thank you. I enjoyed it. Dankeschön. <laughs>